So I had like this whole video, like coronavirus video planned out. I like recorded myself every day. Um, I think like the second day, like the second day I started, I filmed myself and just, you know, said my symptoms and stuff like that. But I figured I'm not even gonna bother because I'm sure you know somebody or you yourself have been affected, has been affected by coronavirus in some way. And everyone knows all about it anyway, so I figured why share in detail my experience with it. But um, it's very nice out today, and actually is actually. <laughs> um, I have to go get like a retest. I wasn't supposed to. Like the doctor never said anything about having to get a retest or anything. But I just wanted to make sure after 10 days that I was cleared, you know, I, I got cleared, but uh, I just wanted to check and get another test and see and make sure that I still don't have it before I go to the grocery store, go to the gym, and just continue everyday life. You know, I don't want to spread it. Look at this one, that's a good one right there. Hey, right, can you read that? I'll zoom it in. So yeah, right now I'm on my way to get like a nose swab thingy. I guess you do it yourself and then you give it to them and then you gotta wait or whatever. Yeah. Go ahead and break that bottom part off. Break this? Yep. Hot inside into your nose, about to the bridge of your nose, swirl it around twice, and then hold it there for 15 seconds, and then you'll repeat the same thing on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> that means you did it right. <laughs> ah. This? Yep, and then open up the lid and then put it cotton side down into it and your results will be emailed to you in two to seven days and then if you're positive you will also get a phone call. Alright. Okay, any questions at all? No, thank you so much. Alright, thank you. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Ugh. I am dying. That hurt. <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna try to make this as quick as I can. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to share this with you guys. Um, so I went to an urgent care and got my initial test for Corona, right? And came back positive. They said, okay, 10 days from now, you know, you have to quarantine and stay inside and stay away from, from people. The next day I called and scheduled uh, <clears throat> a retest at a different facility. Um, what was it, a Rite Aid? a ride aid here and that was on the 10th I scheduled it to take it on the 10th day right and then you got to wait a couple days for uh, the results to come back so the day I was cleared um, is the day I got the second test just to make to, just to make sure right so I got the test and then I had to wait three days and the results came back and they were positive so yeah, those, that second test that I took was positive. Even though I didn't have to take it, I just wanted to take it for peace of mind. So this is kind of how this coronavirus spreads is that first facility I went to, you know, so they said quarantine for 10 days, right? Well, I did that, but I was still positive. So there's like a grace period where it's like, you know, yeah, they say 10 days, but you should do like 15 or 
probably even 20 days, you know, because they don't know exactly when your symptoms, I told them exactly that day, my symptoms started to, to show. And yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, one place might say, make sure you get a retest. One place might say you're good. Make sure you get a retest. And just to make sure that you're good and you don't spread this thing. Oh yeah, one more thing too. Um, <clears throat> what I wanted to say, I, this is just my experience, okay? This, it's completely different from anyone else's, right? Everyone has their own unique experience with coronavirus. My experience was that I felt a relief and like this big stretch, like when I got Corona, you know, I was like, oh my goodness, you know, um, am I going to make it? Am I not? You know, what's going to happen long-term and all that stuff. And it's been about three weeks now since I had it. And I'm starting to feel a lot better. Like the past couple of days, I felt a lot better. And there's just been this relief, like this past year since the pandemic started, it's been like, oh my goodness, when am I going to get it? You know, who, if I'm going to get it. And I believe that everyone's going to get it at some point in the future. Um, but yeah, my experience was that I got it and now it's just kind of like a relief. Um, there's a 99 point whatever percent chance that you're gonna survive this. I know a lot of people have died. Um, but yeah, I got it and I was sick for like five days and then slowly started to get, it was just like cold symptoms, like I had a cold. Um, I was way sicker before in the past. My fever didn't even go up. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to quickly share that with you guys. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs>